and I don't, I don't take and say this will be the last time I will speak about this in social media, because it was the only way I was saying I said the way I can clarify my name of all these accusations now to go through the legal process because I studied political science. I was like, we was to get more elected for law, and I know say there are three type of justice: social justice, which is the court of public opinion; legal justice, which is court of law; and divine justice. If you miss, if you if you you escape social justice, you don't go escape uh, legal justice. If you escape legal justice, you don't go escape uh, what's it divine, justice. divine justice. So if she they win for the court of public opinion, I see comments and so on. But that people don't like me before because of Big Brother or Allah. I don't I don't care. I will. The only thing that you will see from now on, I'm filing a petition. That's, that's what I want to do. I want to take so that he who alleges must come and prove. If you say, Kes, they do this one, you go come prove, say, Kes, they do this one. You see that boy, I don't, I don't know, I don't know from any, I don't know his aim, why they do all the same they do. The boy with that who hack my account. Naim, now they talk any and now say, my, it was if, if you go to Tosi Silver Down page, the first, uh -huh. the team I see, say, I they beat my wife, she did bleed, um, she gave me 10 million. Now he's not carrying the matter for her. That boy, you know, not, she not, the boy don't know who they deal with. The, that my wife, now serpent, he go lead you for front. He go run, I'm sure by now she go run away from the country. Because if I petition that woman, she don't go going there. Because since now you are keep person, the police will not follow due process because they don't want to say anybody will come, they, they can't call me anybody last last. Lady in question, what's her name again? Not your wife. Christy. Yeah. Miss Christy. Okay. Have you ever given her money before? Why would I give her money? The reason because I saw a receipt that says you were transferring money to her or something of that. When so I read before, the conversation... Excuse me, please. Before you before you make this, before you say this thing, the receipt that you saw, go and check, go and confirm. You can confirm the name on the receipt if it was Christie's name. You can go and confirm now, please. Okay. Yeah. Um... Okay, did you guys live together at a point, or are you living together, or do you live together? We don't live together. Did you live together at a point? We did not live together. Simple and short. Was there a time you guys lived together? We did not live together. <laughs> okay, you guys never lived in the same flat before together. I'm saying the same thing. You're still asking me the same question. No, I don't understand. That's why I'm emphasizing on it. I'm saying why do you, that we do you not understand? Together. Um, Samaria, is there anything that is prodding you to suggest that they live together? Yeah, because um, the receipt says that um, they live together, and when I went through the comment section, people were kind of asking, like, why would a married man be living or sharing an apartment but he with a single lady? He has just said that he did not live with her, okay? That is. Please, I'm trying to understand the English. Sorry, you know, sometimes I don't understand English properly. If it's I don't live or I never live with her, which I, I never, I, I never okay. live and I don't live. Now, if you have proof that Kes and her live together, like for instance, you you know what when they say somebody lives together, you know mm -hmm. what the proof is? You go to their house, their time towel. Mm -hmm. You understand? You go to their you go to their house at 12 midnight for instance and then you see two plates they just finished eating that's evidence that they live together someone is dropping a comment section that i was living in the same apartment compound and they live together who is the person honestly speaking guys for those of you who watch big brother niger level up who attest to the fact that Kes carried himself as a responsible married man that it would be very difficult for anybody to question his loyalty to his wife. That is why it is very, very confusing and surprising to me hearing this kind of gist. Kes involving in a marriage scandal. Honestly speaking, I find it very, very difficult to believe this story. But at the same time, I am still wondering the rationale behind Christio Gidifaya and Dotu telling us on Gidifaya's life that this team was just a prank that they decided to do it just to make Christio and Kez trend as Big Brother Niger All Stars was coming to an end. Then when I discovered that it was not just a prank, Kez's wife actually released those receipts showing us that Christio and Kez have been cheating on her. Guys, I found it very, very difficult and I was just asking the rationale behind Christio, Gidifaya and Dotu saying those things online. Um, 
Mama not be smart, you know, at this point, I do not even know what to believe and what not to believe, but we will still get to the root of the matter. You guys, welcome to this afternoon hot gist with celebrity Omo. In this particular afternoon hot gist, now where would they talk about many things where they happen with all your favorite Big Brother Niger celebrities? So, subscribe to this channel if you are not yet subscribed. Omo not be smart, you know, this car that you are seeing up here is what they will be giving Elebaye today during her prize handover. Remember that a few hours from now, Elebaye winner's prize presentation will begin. And guy, no be smart, you know, this magnificent car that you are seeing up there, Elebaye will officially become a car owner as she is going to be driving it, using it to be cruising up and down the whole time as she is the winner of Big Brother Niger All Stars. Once again, congratulations to her and congratulations to Maria Chike. Omo, um, Maria Chike just delivered a bouncing baby boy, and her fellow S Big Brother Niger housemates have been sending their good wishes, congratulating her for giving birth to a bouncing baby boy. Omo um, Ike Onyema, who decided to give her some basketballs a few hours ago, as well, congratulated her. And why Ike? gave her this bus boost was because of the fact that Maria Chike was very very certain that Messi AK was going to win Big Brother Niger All Stars as she mock and tease EK for actually saying that he is going to make sure that Messi AK did not win Big Brother Niger All Stars. Then after the final show on Sunday and Messi AK did not eventually become the winner of Big Brother Niger All Stars, EK decided to revisit what Maria told her by telling her that, you see, I have forgiven you. I understand that peace is not only possible, it is inevitable. Go and see no more. Hashtag Queenmaker. Hashtag Ike Onyema. Remember that the moment Ilebayo was declared the winner of Big Brother Niger All Stars, Ike decided to assume the office of a Queenmaker as he is now a safe acclaimed Queenmaker as he is parading himself as an instrument that God has been using to bring in winners of Big Brother Niger show anytime he is on the show. Even though some people have more and tease him to ask him why is it that you are always claiming that you are the instrument that God uses to bring in winners are you not also good enough to be crowned the winner of Big Brother Niger show or more people have been teasing him left and right but he is both enough to wear it or to wear the crown as queen makers of Big Brother Niger show even though at some point Kidwaya have also claimed that he was one of the people that also made Ilebaye to win Big Brother Niger show. Omo, I'm like, a way. Ilebaye don't win the Big Brother Niger show now. A lot of people are now claiming that they are the one that made her the winner. Omo, no be smart, you know, this is where we'll be ending this afternoon hot gist because a few hours from now, we'll be witnessing the winner's prize presentation and I wouldn't even want to miss out from it. So, this is I'll be ending today afternoon hot gist. Thanks for watching to this point. Go ahead, let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Subscribe to my channel, click on the notification bell button, and please do not forget to give this particular video a very big thumbs up.